What's up guys, this is the Fat Camel uh, And I'm bringing you guys some game Some gameplay commentary of Ion um, This game is an MMORPG game As you can see uh, And I'll, I'll show you guys some cool stuff about this game So uh yeah, this game is made by NCSoft, um, and NCSoft, I I believe, I believe they're Korean. Yeah, uh, yeah, I think they're I think they are Korean. I mean, this game is made by Korean, so yeah. Anyways, so uh, yeah, a bunch of cool stuff about this game. Let me see, what what is there? Um, let me let me think. Uh. Yeah, so um, my character right here is uh, a spirit master. Right here, spirit master, as you can see. Um, these are my gears. You know, check out the stats and all that. Pretty, pretty cool stuff. Pretty cool stuff. My orb and uh, let me see my skills right here. Let's go to chains. All these are um, my skills, and they are. Uh, they um, they chain into different skills. Uh, if you can, yeah, let's see right here. Yeah, all these. So yeah, uh, as spare masters, you can summon spirits. Let me show you here. Uh, you know, summon summon fire spirits, summon wind spirits, earth spirits, water spirits, and then there's tempest spirits. Uh, for in order for me to cast tempest spirits, you have to have uh, two thousand DP. DP is I think uh, Deva points, and you can eat this jelly to recover four thousand DP. Yeah. Anyways, uh, I'm gonna show you my fire spirit. Some of my fire spirit. Yep, and there is my fire spirit. You know, pretty cool looking. It's a, it's a fire spirit. And I can tell this fire spirit to go attack. You know, this this flying bird thing. Bam! The bird is dead. Uh, my level right now is 55, and the level cap uh, recently changed. Um, they they passed it, and the level cap right now is at 60. Uh, so I'm pretty 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 up there. It was uh, it was 55, so I was you know I was level capped, but they patched it, so. Um, it's it's 60 now, so I'm trying to get back to into this game. Uh, I haven't played this game in forever, so yeah, I'm gonna tell this tell this uh, tell my spirit to go attack this. All right. Well. Let's. Uh, I'm almost. I'm almost to level 56. So let's 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 get on that. Yeah. Another cool about uh, cool thing about this game is that you can you can fly in this game, as you can see. Yeah. But you can only fly in certain areas like this. Uh, but you can glide. The rest of uh, the rest of the areas. So yeah, there you go. Uh, I'm gonna actually. On summoning my fire spirit. There we go. Uh, yeah, so MMORPG game, there's a bunch of uh, people playing. So, like this guy is flying right now. And uh, let me show you guys another cool stuff. Let me go right here. Go to the broker. So, like, you can sell your items. And sell a bunch of stuff, and once you sell it, um, you get you get the money when when people buy it. As you can see, like right here, you can buy this, and uh, J Dog would get this money if I buy this item. But 
uh, part of the money goes goes to the game. Let me show you here. Influence rate. So there's there's taxes and you know prices right here. Um, and uh, when you start out the game, there's two races you can choose from: the Ilios and the Ismorians. Uh, these are you know basically the opposite sides, the good and the bad. And Bilars are the the mobs, basically. Uh, in the abyss, let me show you, abyss right here. Um, Asmodea is the Asmodian land, and Elysia is the Elios land. And you know, Elios can't go to Asmodea, and Asmodeans can't come to uh, Elysia. But what they can do is go to abyss. They uh, both both of the races come can go to abyss and <coughs> fight over these. Fortresses, you know, like this fortresses and uh, uh, artifacts. So you can you can fight over these um, and conquer them, and that's how you get your races influence ratio up. And when you have uh, your influences ratio up, uh, the prices drop and the taxes drop. And when the taxes drop, uh, when you sell stuff on the broker. Um, you know the tax the part of the money that goes into the game is lessened uh, therefore you get more money off of selling stuff uh, on the broker so uh, this game is all about PvP so like you you, you fight the uh, as Elios you fight the Asmodeans um, and when you fight the Asmodeans and get fortresses and stuff and when you kill an Asmodean uh, you get abyss points and abyss points are basically the how you tell Kosu and you know a, a pro from Noob in this game. The more abyss points you have, you can get uh, you can get you know better PVP gear. One of the best gears uh, are you can only buy with abyss points. And as you can see here, abyss rank. Um, uh, this isn't much right now. Soldier for level rank five is I'm only right here, but you know all of these. This is the rank, and you know Asmodean individuals. This guy is at the top right now with 50, 51 million, um, uh, which is crazy. I don't even know how you get that much uh, of this points. But anyways, yeah, this is the Legion. I'm on. I'm currently on maximum game. Um, I mean, our legion is not doing that bad. We're up here somewhere. We're up here somewhere. Oh, there it is. Thirty-four. And we we have uh, you know almost uh, 160 million at this point. <laughs> so yeah. So you. Um, this game is all about PvP. You know. And uh, the reason I chose um, Spirit Masters is they're really good at PvP because they have this thing called fear. And when you use this, uh, let me show you. Let me go back down here. When you go back down here, uh, and use fear on this bird. Um, you know they run, they run, they run around in circles doing nothing, and then you can just root them. And oh, not sure. Okay, the NPCs just aggroed. Okay, but like this guy, you can. Uh, I'm gonna actually wait for the cooldown. You can like summon your spirit. This is a wind spirit. Yep pretty cool you know I can target this and then fear him and then when he's running around in circles doing nothing I can just cast a lot of my skills put a bunch of dots on him and then I could do that I could do this with um, you know I could do this with uh, enemy like Asmodians when, when I'm PvP so I can just stick uh, stick my spirits on him tell him to go attack and when he gets close, I can just fear him or root them. And I have this thing called Fear Shriek, uh, which is an AoE fear. 
So when they come close, I can just fear them all and you know put a bunch of uh, damage over time spells because uh, spear masters have a lot of damage over time spells. Um, and you know you can just you know they're 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 really good at PvP. So that's why I chose spear masters. Um, and to show you the rest of this game, let's actually go to character selection and let me show you the uh, process of creating a new character. This game is actually really, really, really pretty. You know, as you can see, good crack, good graphics, and all of that. Uh, let me show you all my characters here. You know, Templar, Ranger, Chainers, Priest. Another priest. Then when you when you first make your account, um, when you when you first when you first choose uh, a side to side on, um, you have to you have to choose, and then you have to stick with that side. You can't make uh, Anelios and an Asmodian in the same in the same account unless you pay for it with no money. So you can read this right here. The light side and the dark side. And go to the next. And then um, you can choose from four classes: uh, warrior, scout, mage, and priest. And these four classes divide into two subclasses. The warrior can uh, become a gladiator, which is um, they 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 use uh, you know great swords or pole pole arms. And they do. They specialize in like big AOE damage, as you can see right here. Gladiators, powerful melee attacks, and Templars, uh, protection and defense. Uh, scouts, that can turn to assassins. Melee combat ability maximize. Uh, you know, melee combat uh, or um, rangers. You know, who uses bow and arrow, as you can see right here. Uh, mages, they can uh, become sorcerers with uh, good, like really, really big burst damages, big spell casts, or spirit masters, which is uh, what I am. Elemental spirits, you know, uh, dot damage, crowd control, all that stuff. Priests can become uh, clerics, who uh, who is the healer of the party, um, and chanters. Oh, isn't oh, Chainers, there you go. Who um, who is like the support of the group, support character of the group? Um, you know, uh, they can cast uh, mantras. Mantras are like uh, you have. They they can cast mantras, up to three mantras, um, and they uh, give your group, the whole group, uh, bonus stats. And it, it's a pretty big boost, so uh, chainers are really important. Like late game or early game, you know, pretty fun, and they can they can do some serious damage too. So um, let me just create a character, and you can uh, choose a face, you know, a simple face. You know, go down these you know, pretty pretty cool faces, but uh, you can like go to events and then like, uh, customize it there's a there's a lot of customization in this um, so you guys can mess around with it uh, body you know lean body large body whatever small body muscular child body whatever yeah and then you can customize it too But anyways, height. I'm not gonna actually uh, make a character right now. I'm gonna actually do my crease. I get my cleric leveled up. So when you first start out the game, uh, you they put you in this uh, land called Poeta. And when you do, uh, at, so level one through 
1 through 10, you have to stay here and level up and do the quest line and all that. And then after this, you can go to the main, main, uh, you know, main uh, island, this whole thing right here. And, uh, you know, quest line and then level up and do all that, you know, all that good stuff. Yeah, so anyways, uh, group, you can have uh, up to six people in one group and uh, as you can see right here and alliances is when uh, you have multiple groups and you can form an alliance and you know like I said go to uh, Abyss and take these forts down uh, against Asmodians or Balars. Balars are just mobs so any of us can just go take this right now. Uh, yeah. So yeah, let me let me just show you guys uh, a little bit of questing and stuff. Yeah, you can double click on these and uh, to see what you have to do and stuff. Teleport statue, that's new. Pick up some quests. There we go. Pick up this. Yeah, little, little shortcut, I mean, little screenshot, and then you know, gives you the quest right here. So I'm gonna go to my quest, do all this, and then go kill some, go kill some bell, bell pigs, which are over here somewhere. Up oh, there it is. Oh! Boom! Kill this. No. And then kill that guy. Testing right now. Kill some bell pigs. Boom. 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 Um. Thing, all that good stuff. And I'm actually gonna rest for a bit because I'm kind of low. Yep. So yeah, let me let me guys uh let me uh let me know if you guys enjoy some gameplays because uh, I'm trying to get back onto this game. So I'm gonna post more uh, gameplays. So if you guys let me know if you guys want to see more. Uh, other than that, uh, I'll uh, cut it right here because uh, you know, it's actually pretty boring to see you know, the whole questing and uh, it's it's repetitive. That's what I'm trying to say. So yeah, see you guys later.